having trouble getting the right answer for the sonar velocity problem, let me show you what you need to do. First, I'm going to reset the simulation back to the beginning. I'm going to pause it, and you'll see that there is a torpedo heading toward our sublocation. When we resume, you'll notice that the sonar is sweeping out circles looking for enemy torpedoes. You'll notice it's got a sweep frequency of six revolutions per minute. I'm going to pause the simulation again right here. We can see that the torpedo is on this line. Since each of these lines are 800, the torpedo is 4 kilometers away, 4,000 meters. I then count my sweeps until it gets to another easily measurable location. So as this thing goes, each time it sweeps by the direction of the torpedo, we'll see it show up, so that's one. It's important not to lose count. The more sweeps you do, the more accurate your number should be. Don't let your torpedo get too close to your sub, though, so that's two. That's three. And finally, four. We can see we're just a hair over 1,600 and we went through four sweeps. So once you got your numbers, it's now time to do your calculations. So you might want to start with your starting location. We we're at 4,000 meters. Our ending location we have to guesstimate. So I'm going to guesstimate at about 1610 meters. We went through four sweeps and it was sweeping at a rate of six revolutions per minute. So that means each revolution takes 10 seconds. Okay, so since we had four sweeps, that gives us a time of 40 seconds. The distance we covered would be um, 2,390. Meters. This is about 2400, so we can knock that off, and at 2400, that's about 60 meters per second. Okay, so it's going to be slightly less than 60 meters per second. You don't have to be perfect, but you want to be close, within about 5% of the right answer. So when you're done, hit end, put in your name. and the value that you got for your speed in meters per second. Submit. It will tell you what the true answer should have been. Like we said, slightly less than 60. Our answers were close enough, so you can now share this information with your teacher so they know that you are able to do this type of problem.